go, Diego, go. Diego and Poppy to the rescue. Hola, I'm Diego and I'm an animal rescuer. This is my sister Alicia and this is our Poppy. Poppy is an animal expert too. Do you hear something? It sounds like an animal is calling for help. Let's find out which animal it is. Click the camera will help us find the animal in trouble. Zoom through the forest to find the animal calling for help. Click. Oh no! There are two animals in trouble. Two baby pygmy marmosets. They're in that tree near the waterfall. They look lost. I know! My puppy and I can help the baby pygmy marmosets find their puppy. Poppy says Alicia and I should check the computer to find out more about pygmy marmosets. That way, we can figure out where Poppy pygmy marmoset might be. The computer says pygmy marmosets are the smallest monkeys in the world. Each pygmy marmoset weighs less than a grapefruit. The computer also says that pygmy marmosets live high in trees and eat tree sap. Their coats help them blend in with the forest so they can hide. Poppy says that because pygmy marmosets eat tree sap, we can probably find Poppy pygmy marmoset near the sap tree. Let's go rescue the babies and bring them to the sap tree to find their puppy. Here we go! Animal rescuers away! Al rescate! To the rescue! I hear a waterfall! There it is! The baby pygmy marmosets must be in this tree next to the waterfall. We just have to find a way to get to the top. We can climb! Climb with us! Climb! Climb! Sube! Sube! I hear a whistling noise. Who could be whistling? Poppy says pygmy marmosets make a whistling sound. So we're probably hearing the baby pygmy marmosets. It is the baby pygmy marmosets. They say they were playing follow the leader in the tree branches while their poppy was getting food for them and now they're lost. Ah, we'll help you find your poppy babies. Poppy says that if Poppy Pygmy Marmoset was getting food, then he must be at the sap tree. Let's go find him. Poppy knows a shortcut to the sap tree. We just have to find a way over the waterfall. Rescue Pack can help. To help Rescue Pack transform into something that can get us over the waterfall, say activate. Rescue Pack turn into a hot air balloon. Great work, Rescue Pack. Now we can fly over the waterfall to get to the sap tree and Poppy Pygmy Marmoset. Excellente! We made it to the other side of the waterfall. And there's the sap tree. But wait! Why is the sap tree shaking? It's the Bobo Brothers. They are dancing around the sap tree making it shake. If we don't stop them, Poppy Pygmy Marmoset could fall out of the tree. Help me stop the Bobo Brothers. Shout, freeze Bobos! The Bobo Brothers said they are sorry. Thanks for helping me stop them. Now the sap tree isn't shaking anymore. But why are the baby pygmy marmosets shaking now? Something is scaring them. Oh no! A harpy eagle is flying toward us. Pygmy marmosets are afraid of harpy eagles. Let's help them hide so the harpy eagle will fly right past us. Poppy says their color helps them hide in the tree branches. Let's crouch down in the branches and hide like pygmy marmosets. That was good hiding. The harpy eagle flew right past us. But now I don't see Puppy Pygmy Marmoset. Maybe he hid in the sap tree because he was scared by the harpy eagle too. Puppy says that Puppy Pygmy Marmoset is probably using his dark coat to blend in with the tree. Let's use the spotting scope to see if we can find him. There's Puppy Pygmy Marmoset. Let's tell him it's safe to come out of hiding now. Let's help the baby pygmy marmosets call to their puppy. Call out, puppy! Hola, puppy pygmy marmoset. I'm Diego, and this is my puppy. We brought your babies back to you. Puppy knows how much puppy pygmy marmoset must have missed his babies because he's a puppy too. Puppy pygmy marmoset is so happy to have his babies back. Thank you for helping us bring them back to their puppy. Gracias. Now the pygmy marmosets can get some tree sap and have dinner together. First they need to make a hole in the tree. Then they suck out the yummy sap. Poppy says it's our dinner time too. Let's go home. Rescue complete. Mission completa. 
Did you know? Teeny weeny. The pygmy marmoset is the smallest monkey in the world, weighing only a half a pound. Up in the trees. The pygmy marmosets have dark bodies that help them stay camouflaged in the trees. Busy days. Pygmy marmosets are very active. They run, jump, and leap in trees and shrubs all day long. All in the family. Pygmy marmosets live in family groups of two to six. Twins are born every five to six months. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and share and follow me on Instagram. See you next time.